Oh no. We well, got you on tape for trying to kill me. Okay. Hand me camera, I'll point it that way. Well, I want to hand me the camera. Because I want that away so you can show that he's. Or try to lie about killing me. Right in the ear. See all that ear hair? Okay. So your name is? Slim Shady. Alright, so from the back, you can see the front. Hello, Ariet. Hello, everybody. Hello. Bubby, say hello, you little bastard. You see the... At least that chair spins around, but that's coming out. And I got a skylight, which is holding water, at least right now. So, this actually does have... Oh, we can see it earlier. Two burner stove. A refrigerator that actually works pretty well. A sink. Overhead cabinets. Shitty ass wallpaper. Yeah. And a micro little toilet area but this is definitely not big enough for any full-size adult so it's gonna have to come out I did I not say full-size adult a tiny person could fit in that bathroom but that's about it the, these are actually in pretty good shape they're comfortable too but uh, they are definitely coming out because they do not. Uh, they do definitely do not work for what I want to do for the thing. So let's go outside and we'll start looking at stuff. You know we have yet to actually pop the hood. Oh, there we go. You can do it now. <laughs> okay. View from the outside. Sorry for the windiness. It's getting ready to rain. The 79 Chevy Santana. There you go. I just picked this thing up. Got rid of my Tahoe. One gas guzzler for another, but at least this one I can go camping in. I've never done this before. Well, I don't know what that thing is if it's not a latch. The hood's right there. If you don't want to look at the engine, you got to take that thing right there off. Well, you can't pop the actual hood? Uh, maybe, just to uh, check it I guess it doesn't like matter. That. I'm not going to unbolt that from the floor right this second. Uh, see my little slike like LP gas hookups there. Power in. Spare tire, heavy duty towing assembly. Hello, Elliot. Uh, you can see why we've decided we're going to take and gut this thing. You can see some of the wood is even up around the shell needs to be replaced. Can you see that okay? Water tank looks good. I don't know, I may reuse the water tank. Just trying to get rid of the water tanks and systems. Up under there would be, way back there would be a gray water system, a black water system. Okay, well, that's pretty much the before of my New van. We're going to the front. Hello, Elliot. They're pretty. They're both still pretty loose. Okay. Yeah, you're right. You really can't see much. This it's fairly cluttered up up front. So most of the access will be from inside. Well, if you have to do any spark plug work or anything like that, but as far as just uh. There's Checking the fluid levels. Drain. I mean the uh, that's the oil, oil dipstick. This other one over here broke off. This is 
Transmission dipstick. Transmission here to be replaced. Tire steering right down there. Okay. And then, uh, of course, you got your master cylinder. It does still have the compressor. I'm impressed. Yeah. And then the compressor is not locked up. See here? Excellent. The compressor's not locked up, but see how loose this belt is? Look at this. And his new belt. Well, at least tightened up. I can see what you do to tighten it. See right here? You just take a wrench and turn this, and it, it'll tighten, it'll bring this pulley up and tighten that thing right, right up. The alternator's got a slide pulley on it as well. Yeah, the, the alternator needs to be tightened too because it's a, it's loose too. So this is a single alternator system, is that right? Yep. Okay. Okay. But uh, you can see here, this thing here is a converter that converts from 110 to uh, 12 volts. This is, that's what runs your power stuff on the inside. We found the uh, plug-in was on that side, by the way. Yeah. Which I need to do, I guess, at some point. Well, either that or open the refrigerator. Yeah, I'll probably just open the refrigerator for now. It's about to rain anyway. This thing's got a one, two, at least two if not three core cooler on it.